We're here. <clears throat> Let's get to it. My son a little congested. Uh, I thought I closed the window when I fell asleep. I think I left it open though. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe it was just cold as f in my house or my apartment. It was cold as hell because I woke up and I was shit up freezing. <laughs> Bro, I, I feel like I'm always fighting the blood moon in this damn mod. All right, last time we left off, we fought the like moon jelly wizard, and then we got this armor I'm wearing, this marble armor or granite armor, and then there was also this marble armor. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Do I have another chest I could put right here? There you go. I'm putting the weirdest chest. So our next boss, Snap Trapper, Jungle Surface, and then after that's the Vine Wrath Bane. Oh, but first we go to the dungeon. We check if we can find an early water bowl. Ah, I didn't think he was going to spawn that early. <laughs> okay, I'm not seeing any early water bolts. Uh, water bolt. Can we craft it? We need dungeon tokens, so we can't craft it. All right, it's fine. I didn't want to craft it anyways. I don't need a summon. Nah, I really wanted that summon. It kind of sucks. All right, next boss is the Vine Wrath Bane. That's, that's easy. We could take that boss on. Does the spear mod just like up how often the blood moon spawns, bro? Ah, here we are. I still really can't see down here. I don't like that nighttime makes this area darker. It's kind of annoying. Unless I'm playing a Terraria horror mod, I don't want the game to be darker than it already is. Yeah, walk into this. I'm going back to the house. We're buying some light potions. Let me get the shine and the night perfect and let's fight the vine wrath bane hopefully uh we're prepared enough for this let's drink everything here okay i don't know where the night owl or this one didn't drink all right vine wrath bane let's do it slowly taking poison damage for some reason okay i gotta remember the boss fight because i 100 percent don't oh i dodged that completely on purpose right there Hey, do I have a summon? Oh, I should brought summon potion. My summons low-key like carried me in the last fight. I think they would have did the same this fight. Okay, so we gotta watch out for the spikes. It does a dash every now and then. It does this. She's a little projectile. Oh, dash coming. Oh yeah. Good good dodge game ready. Bad dodge game here. Can't really get the tell there. Does his head have a hitbox? I feel like I shot at his head a couple times and I missed. That has a hitbox, I'm pretty sure. Okay, so he turns red a little bit. That's a little bit of a tell. Not, not the greatest tell because he turns red and then dashes immediately. But it's still a tell, nonetheless. That shit kind of hurt. I got hit for like 50 by something. I like this boss fight though. It may not be like the most like varied boss fight, but like it's got me on my toes. I'm still dodging this stuff. I'm still able to dodge. It's not like the type of attacks that you can't dodge like at all. All right, we're entering phase two, baby. I don't remember phase two. Okay, shoot balls. Oh, I can see. I can actually see, holy shit. My eyes. So he does the same dash attack, he's a little bit faster. Oh, he does it three times. Shoots the balls, the little Plantera balls, but thanks to our arena, we're chilling. Let's uh, make sure to use our J Dragon. Our J Dragon seems like Loki, the strongest hitting weapon. Okay, he did that fast as hell. I was not expecting that. Okay, I don't like the poison he's leaving behind. That's a little dangerous. That poison does not leave a lot of room. And there you go, fight over. That's a pretty cool boss. Kept me on my toes the whole fight. Godly thorn shot. Briar blossom. Double tap up to ensnare an enemy. Let me see this thing. I, I don't know. What does it do? Wooden arrow split into poisonous thorns. Let's test it on this guy. <laughs> we'll test it on the Everglade. Or the Glade Wrath, not Everglade. I don't know where the fuck I got Everglade from. Hey, where are you going? You going straight to the arena, right? Nowhere else? <laughs> Not trying to run away, right? Adam. Oh my God, we're still on the mushroom quest. All right, let's see this in, in action. The uh, the Briar Blossom here. 
Okay. Interesting to say the least. Oh, it's kind of cool. I'll keep it for now. That's all it does. It doesn't do anything else. It's just double tap to ensnare an enemy. I don't feel like that's like a good enough feature to remove a whole accessory. That's what we were doing last time. I fucking remember. We're trying to find a mushroom biome and we just couldn't. Do you think mushroom biomes are usually connected to uh, jungles? Maybe we can find one in the jungle. We got to go to the jungle either way. Okay. Oh, you know what we should do? Let's fight Scarabus. I'll fight Scarabus like a couple more times. Why does the new biome look like a boot? What, this biome looks like a boot? I don't know what type of boot you wear, you fucking crow-footed ass. Let's do it. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, calm down, calm down. Summon? It's, it's getting to the point to where it's too many for this summon. It's a good summon, I think, too, or at least like a decent ground summon. If we don't get the summon this time, bro, I, I give up on it completely. Like, I've been wanting a new summon. We've been using the same one for a minute now. <sighs> it's just it's destiny that I don't get that summon. Nine kills. Nine kills, and I never got that summon. All right, but yeah, we're going to the jungle. We're trying to find a mushroom biome. That's our main quest. But just to my luck, my game raider's luck, mushroom biome has been uh, rare. Super rare. <gasps> Snap trapper, we found the mini boss. Get him. <laughs> mini boss dead. Spore one. <gasps> Summons a snap spore. Did we get a new summon after begging for one? Oh my god. Okay, I will say something about the summons from this mod. They're kind of small as shit. I can barely see the summon. Look at these summons. Why are they so tiny? I still feel like I'm really weak throughout this whole playthrough, you know? Maybe that's a good thing. Maybe that just means this mod is really well balanced. Like, even in vanilla terror, yeah, I'd be, like, super strong at this point. Whoa, whoa, whoa! My fucking back heel got touched. I went to a flea market with my friends yesterday, and that shit was pretty fucking fun. <laughs> I collect a lot of, uh... Sports jerseys? Well, not a lot. I mainly have, like, a bunch of NBA jerseys. I bought my first baseball jersey, and then I saw a baseball jersey there. They had a fucking Jordan White Sox one, and I was like, yo, that's some heat. I bought it. I bargained with the guy a little bit. Got, like, a pretty good discount on it. Now I got a Jordan uh, so Sox jersey. I always thought it was interesting how Michael Jordan fucking win the baseball <laughs> in the middle of his fucking prime. That's like if I were to go to like Roblox. That's like the equivalent of Michael Jordan going in a baseball. I'm looking for a mushroom bomb. I gotta remember that. Completely forgot I was looking for them because like none of them are spawning. Come on, where are the mushroom bombs at? This is what we're gonna spend most of the playthrough doing. We're too low. If we're seeing lava, are we too low for a mushroom bomb? This is so annoying because I wanna see what the next quest is. <laughs> but you can't tame. Oh, okay, I guess we're finding the Queen Bee now. We might lose this fight. <laughs> We don't really have an arena to work with. And the queen bee is fucking soaring, bro. She is flying like she's never flown before. Look at her. She's doing fucking drive-bys. How am I supposed to fight her? <laughs> hey, she's standing still for me. Because I'm moving a lot, she's moving a lot. Like, holy shit. <laughs> My health is not looking the greatest. If I just had like five more seconds to set up an arena, this would be the most dominant fight in history. But my summon said, no, we're starting the fight, whether you like it or not. Like, I won't even blame my summon. I'll blame the enemy that spawned, like, that attracted my summon down there. Because my summon goes through walls, and it had to attract to something underground. If I could just, like, get a potion off without getting hit, that would be good enough for me. Like, a whole phase without getting hit. There's a slime where I stand. Can get out of here? Okay, that was pretty good. I pretty much did a phase without getting hit. At least I didn't take, like, crazy damage. So that means I could heal and have decent health now. She's going crazy now. Go crazy! Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> fucking point blank ran up on me and spawned bees on me. Hey! Dead boss. We did get the yo-yo, which is actually kind of nice. 
Bro, where the fuck are the mushroom biomes at? This is the only mushroom biome I've seen. It's only like the edge of it. I I'm just gonna go to that mushroom biome. <laughs> I have to. This is the only one I know of. This is insane how much I've been spending trying to find one. We finally found a mushroom vine. Whoa, look at that. It only took us two streams. Now I have to find a funny looking mushroom here. Do you guys see a funny looking mushroom? Hey, my boy rattles out. Wait, this is actually rattles? This is the first time we run into rattles in a minute. Rattles is the biggest bitch I've ever known of an NPC. This dude lucked his way into the NPC Olympics and then he fucking sucked ass at all the events. <laughs> and people, st damn, what the fuck? And people still wanted him to win too. That's the crazy part. Hey, I found the mushroom biome, but like the thing that spawns here isn't spawning here. Oh, there it is. Do I need to, do I need to catch it? There you go. I was about to say, like, where the fuck is this thing? Quiver Shroom. It bounces back and forth. Put it in a jar. <laughs> Finally, after two streams of looking for this damn mushroom. It's a cutie for sure. I put this... The word cutie has been ruined for me. Put this critter into a little jar. I'm sure it can spice up my home. We all can use a little bit more cute from time to time. Be funny more. Don't hurt the little things. Okay. Finally, we completed that quest. Can we now officially do the other quests? Some new creepy crawlies have ta taken to calling the caverns their home. Discussing little fellas that belch poison gas and some spiny little buggers. I've got a simple task for you. Do us all a favor and exterminate those nasty things. Killing a dozen of them will surely make the underground less nasty place. This contract shall help you track your mission. What the fuck am I killing? Uh, why? Why? Why has he got to give me this quest after I've killed so many? Killing weezers and cavern crawlers. Ah, what the fuck? That guy exploded. Do, 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 do. We got another one? Oh, yes, we do. Contract complete. Look at that. That was a nice, easy quest. Unlike that fucking last one. <laughs> right, my boy, Adam. Oh, he gave me the whole clatter mode set. Look at that. Taking fatal damage will instead return you to the amount of health you had before death. It's cool. I like that. There's a lot of defense for it, but I like it. What the fuck? Oh, okay. You're aiming with it. I thought I was pissing with it. All right, what's your next quest? We got to slay more stuff. We got to slay Valkyries now. What? How come the Valkyries don't want to spawn all of a sudden? They were spawning so much. I know what pulls the fun out of a lot of Terraria RNG. RNG problems leads to insanity problems. Because doing the same things over and over again and expecting a different outcome. <laughs> That's when the insanity starts to come in. Right. We did. It just took really long. I'm going to read this in my head. <laughs> I had to give him my staff? I had to give him this? <laughs> Does he give it back? I don't want to give this to him. Whatever. Maybe I've been using it too long. It's time to get rid of it. Undead Samurai Vengeful Spirit sounds like a riot. Wish I could have been there. Either way, this whole staff is mighty powerful, quite durable too. Sakura Banzai. What's your next quest? Hopefully one of the things that I have. No. Went roam in the place for an ancient temple. You didn't make it. Real shame that that was a riot. Can I skip this one? <laughs> I feel like exploring this world's massive and even I don't see it all. Easy. We can see that one easy. Here is your quest, sir. Far ends of the world. So what, like go to a dungeon and just sit out here somewhere? Give us a new staff, a light spire. You're gonna send me to a glowing mushroom biome, okay. Okay, I'll go back to the glowing mushroom biome. This one, just stand here. You don't even gotta move. What's the next one? This new monstrosity has got tentacle eyes, fireballs, you name it. Uh, once we kill the gorgon or whatever the fuck, the flying head, beholder. Yeah, I feel like we're behind on these quests. <laughs> Just because it took us so long to do the mushroom one. 
Yeah, I'm pretty easy. That was pretty quick. We're starting. We're starting to knock the quest out. We're not getting stuck on it. Kill some of those big hounds and those thorn stalkers. If I were ever to go pro in a video game, it would have been smite. <laughs> Contract complete. Huh? <laughs> Apparently, I completed it. I only killed like three of the enemies. I'll take it. Not argue. Reading these in my head, by the way. Jungle's a rough place. Okay, well, we're back to this fucking quest. This might be the quest where I tap out. Because what do I have to do? <laughs> Find a sepulcher. I've raided so many sepulchers. There's like one that I didn't raid. Alright. I'll, I'll end the stream now.